Hello, I'm Michelangelo, and I'm your guide to the world of wine. Today we're going to be talking about decanting wine. Now there are three reasons why you'd want to decant your bottle. Uh, first off, if the wine comes out too cold, either a red or a white, sometimes it is a little bit too chilly, and by removing it from that cold, thick glass in the wine bottle and placing it in the thinner glass in a decanter, it's going to allow that wine to come up to temperature faster. Now another reason you'd want to decant a wine is to allow it to open up and release all of its aromatics and flavor potential. Uh, now when a wine is sitting in a bottle, we have just a small amount of surface area that's being exposed to the oxygen. And by placing it in a larger decanter, we have more of that wine being exposed to the oxygen, allowing it to release all those aromatics and flavors. Uh, now, typically you're going to want to decant your bottle about a half hour at least before dinner, depending on the age and how tight the bottle is, how much it needs to open up. Uh, if you forget to do that, we have this cool little device here called the Venturi. Now the Venturi is a wine aerator. You're basically decanting the wine instantly. This, uh, the wine is poured directly from the top, and as it comes through, these two offset air ports are going to allow the oxygen to be rapidly introduced to the wine, spinning as it comes through. So we'll give you a little demo on how this works. Fun little device. Pour the wine directly from the top into the glass, and you can hear it start to suck that oxygen in, and we're instantly opening up that bottle of wine. Now there is a third reason why you'd want to decant. The third reason would be to separate the solids from the wine. Now sediment are those solids. The sediment will form as the color pigments and the tannins in the wine bind together and then fall out as a solid. That's why when we have an older bottle of wine, it tends to be lighter in color as well as softer on the palate. Uh, let's go ahead and demonstrate that now. Now we've chosen a 98 Cabernet, something that's gonna throw a lot of sediment so you can have some good visual clues as to what we're doing here. Now as you can see, I have a candle out. What's that gonna do is it'll illuminate the inside of the bottle as we're pouring the wine into the decanter. This is gonna allow us to see that sediment. Let's begin. So now as we start to pour, we're gonna to wanna to pour a steady stream. We want that stream to be continual the entire time. And as we get closer to the end, we're going to be looking for that sediment, kind of settling in the little crevice there before we get to the neck of the bottle. So we've got a good flow coming right now and it's kind of jumping out a little bit. We want it to be nice and even just like that. So slower pace is better here. Remember, we're trying to keep those solids out. So we do want to be careful. And we're getting down there. And the key here is to look through the top of the bottle here to see those sediments as we get down to the bottom because we don't want to get any of those sediments into the actual decanter. So I think we're going to stop right about there. Okay. Now, as you can see, we've got a little bit of wine left in the bottom. Now, that little bit of waste is better than getting a mouthful of chunks. I can guarantee it. Well, let's go ahead and pour that out so we can see those sediment chunks that have come out of the bottle. And you can see that little bit of kind of dust powder floating in there. That's what we don't want. Gets in your teeth and it's not fun to get out. Now we can enjoy our wine fully decanted, separated of all solids. You can see absolutely clear and beautiful here exactly what we're looking for with the decantation process. Try it at home. Well, there you have it. We've decanted our bottle of wine. All that sediment's been removed from that tasty wine. We've got a nice clean glass here, ready to enjoy. Thank you so much for joining me on your guide to the world of wine, and we'll see you next time. Salud. Oh yeah, that's good stuff. And nothing in my teeth.